what kind of saved the day back then also was this supersymmetry concept, the concept of supersymmetry or SUSY. So supersymmetry is quite important. I hope it's discovered or something, because I mean, I think string theory would really suffer and the unification of the non-gravitational forces too. You know, anyways, according to this hypothesis of supersymmetry, there is an underlying symmetry between the fermions and the bosons, two families which are treated separately in the standard model. So as you may have picked up on, the fermions and the boson, bosons, brosons, brosons, no, bosons, B-O-S-O-N, the fermions and the bosons are different because of their different spin. But, in the standard model, but the supersymmetry business basically theorizes that every fermion has a boson partner and vice versa, a super partner, if you will. Basically, supersymmetry as a theory gives all the particles a super partner particle. Quarks have bosonic partners called squarks. Neutrinos have neutrinos and so on. So leptons super partner would be sleptons. Okay, and this is real. This is real. Like as in the theory is real. Whether we find them is, is a different matter. Experimentally, I don't know of, you know, Susie particles being found. Um, the theory basically suggests that all these particles have uh, a supersymmetry super partner particle. So lepton would, would have a super partner particle called slepton. Uh, quarks would have a super partner particle called squarks and so on, okay? One of the interesting possibilities of supersymmetry is that at least one of the myriad of particles that one expects to reveal themselves at very high energy might be stable. One of the interesting possibilities of super supersymmetry is that at least one of the myriad of particles that one expects to uh, reveal themselves at very high energy might be stable. Could one of these particles make up the dark matter that seems to pervade the universe? So then he's connecting it to dark matter. So a lot of people, a lot of theoretical physicists want supersymmetry to be real, okay? Because supersymmetry uh, as theorized kind of saves the day for a lot of things, especially to grand like unify the non-gravitational forces as far as I understand. And also it saves the day for string theory 